Hey guys, welcome to the vlog today. Welcome to our new house. How are you feeling about this whole situation? That window. Oh yes, yeah, window. yes, that window. How do you feel about that window? That wooden window, window over there? Uh-huh. This. Yeah, so we decided to, we're going to be putting an offer tomorrow on Monday, so the day you guys see this, on, on this townhouse. On this property right here. This and is so ours. When we were looking at different properties and houses and stuff, we couldn't find any kind of layout that we liked good enough in a single family home in our price range. Something not only that was in our price range that was what we wanted, but something that was open enough. Like, I think that is the thing that we wanted the most in our home is openness. Okay, because it flows from one room to another. When we both work during the day, we get home like at, let's say, 3.30 at night. So. We had to adjust to sleep at seven. So we, and whenever we're- We only have like three and a half hours together as a total family. So we want our night. family to get time together to be together. Yes. Yeah. And like, and one of the things, I love doing yard work, but at the same time, it's a it's a big portion out of your day. And let's be honest, we don't spend that much time outside in our backyard. Right. right. Whenever we go outside, we go to like a park or something. Or a neighbor. And so or as we family. show you throughout this tour of our house, yeah. we'll show you how close we are to a to park. A park. And there's even more parks you always won't even go to see. But the park is literally right behind Kurt's head. Yeah, it's crazy. Right back. Hi. Hi. So where that porter party is, that's the park. It's literally in our backyard. It's amazing. Yep. So. This is gonna be awesome. We are so excited. We can't wait for you guys to share this journey with us. Welcome along our home building experience. Yep. It's pretty cool, huh? What are we at? We're a new house. At our new house? Yeah. Do you love it? So this will be the big garage. It's actually a lot bigger than you really think because there's a lot of extra space on the side. Two car, nice, it'll be finished. When you walk in right here, this will be, end up being a full bath. It's framed for only half half right now, but, gonna but that's going to come out. down and that will be a bathtub. So full bath. And you'll walk into here. I walk in a little bit further. This is the front door. And this is going to be my office. This is the man cave. It's like huge. Go walk in there so you have like an idea of how big it is. This is the man cave. Like it's ginormous. It's like I think it's, I think it might be bigger than like the master bedroom. It really is close. <laughs> yeah, it's like but it's. Humongous massive window. Yep, I like that a lot. So there's that. The nice, nice closet. I like it. It's huge. And then, like Kurt said, this is the front door. It's not the front door. A big patio. And the patio will actually kind of come all the way around it. Yeah, so the patio will actually go like this and go all the way around. It'll be really big. And then right here is kind of like your little entryway. I think what we're going to do is like a little basket or some sort of stand or something because um, we're going to have a no shoes policy. Everyone says that when you first move into a house. Well, but we're I'm going really to try, try really hard to stick and, to And one of the big reasons why too is like this is a good place. So you come in and then there's a good place for like shoes and stuff like that, right? Yep. And um, so you don't track mud. And so you don't track mud. So then you walk up these stairs. Shailene, this sketch is shaking out bad. This part. Oh. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Those are going to be our stairs. I remember there's going to be like a light right here, so it lightens the stairs too. You walk up the stairs, and this is our great big family room. Yeah. So this is the family room. Which it's it's hard to tell right now how big it is, but, but it's, it's actually a pretty big space. Pretty like big. this place will actually, the finished square foot will be actually bigger than our old house's finished square foot, and just not as much like storage area, which is totally fine. So this is where like the TV and yeah, so like the TV, nice big windows, and this big huge window, and this is what it's gonna look like. If you can't, oh, you can't see it from over here. You can see it the other way, I think, but if not, we don't care. Um, there's the temple right here. There's the temple, temple right there. there. Right back behind this building, there's the South Jordan Parkway. Yeah. Um, and then this lot right here is actually where all the framing stuff is, where all that stuff is. It's gonna be a kitty park. It's gonna be a toddler park. Yep. So it's literally <laughs> right there. 15 feet away from our house. So that's gonna be our big toddler park right there, huh? Yeah. 
Are you excited? That tractor will move. That tractor will move. But he's going to build So that's what that is. And then right here, it's what they call a tech room. So, but what we're gonna do is we're most likely gonna this make that gonna Jax's, Jax's playroom. playroom. So we'll put his little table and chairs in there with all of his toys and um, let that be his little creative space. Yep, here. stay away from that though. That, oh, that's gonna be your running place? Is okay. your running room? Show me your running place. Oh yeah, 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 oh my goodness, oh goodness. Careful. All right, and then. So the, like you said, this is like the, the, the family room area. Yep. And then these, so these beams are in because they're still framing, but, and then you'll walk into here. And this is going to be like, um, it's kind of like a linen closet like or like, little... just, pro, I, I bet we'll most, I think we'll probably use it for like where you put like your vacuum and stuff like that. Yeah, like cleaning supplies. Yeah, this is like a coat like closet. A little closet. And then on this side, it's going to be like a little mud room entryway type thing. It's going to have like little coat hooks and boxes and things like that to put like Jackson's backpack when he goes to school. My like, backpack. <laughs> you know, your house slippers if you want that. Things like that will kind of go in this little area. And then there's going to be a half bath right here. Yeah, so it's just like the pedestal and uh, toilet and, and that's it. Which is exactly what you want like on a living area. Like we were looking at other units um, that were just a little bit smaller and we really liked them. But that was one of the big reasons why we wanted it is because of that when you're like next to the kitchen and like the living room and the dining room. Well, and then that that's way just when what it is. This is your main living space, right? When you have guests, things like that, you don't want to make them go either all the way upstairs or all the way downstairs to go to the bathroom. This is the most convenient place for one. Yep. So next is the kitchen. This is Chilling's favorite this part. This is my favorite part of this house. And it's hard because it doesn't do it any justice whatsoever but right now, right? But it is so open and it's going to be so beautiful. I'm so excited. But the island in this kitchen is massive. It's going to start probably right about here. And it's going to take you all the way to here. Yeah, so the, so the island is literally from like all there all the way down. Island. And then back here is going to be all really nice, tall, beautiful cabinets. Um, we've decided to go with white cabinets with like really pretty chrome. Um, chrome, dark, dark, like black. Like no, like chrome handle hardware. Oh, okay. And then on the island, it's going to be um, a chrome undermount sink with black granite countertops. It is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Kind of box. Yep, so that's that. I guess it's not like a lot right of dead space, here, it's just a little right bit. Here. This right here, this is the pantry. Oh yeah, this is the pantry. So it's big enough, you can walk into it, and it, then it goes to here. Yeah. So it's so pretty good size. They fill this whole thing up with shelves this way. Um, and then eventually, if we wanted to, we could add a couple little shelves here. I think what we could probably do like, is like spice we'll racks. A spice rack, things like that. Um, but it's, I mean, the pantry is bigger than the pantry in our house now. It's, it's awesome. Like quite a bit bigger, too. Yeah, it's awesome. So, like, when we're, one thing is that we're next to like a big freeway, like not big freeway, but like a highway. But when all the other buildings come in, it will deafen the sound a lot. Yeah. But when we actually, our first home was actually right on like, 6200 South in Taylorsville. The busiest like, roads in Utah. <laughs> and we actually got like used to it. Like and it was actually kind of soothing. Soothing at night. Um, but there will actually be a, another building like right here as well. And I'll block the sound out a little bit. Yeah. But look at this view, you guys, out of our living room, out of our dining room. You overlook the entire. Salt Lake Salt Lake Valley. County. Like Salt Lake Valley. Like it's Yeah. So amazing. like I said, we'll have about like that view right there where you can see everything. And yeah. then plus there's a nice view this way as well. But look how big that so is. This is the dining room. It's really, really big. And then this is another closet right here. Yep, so another and closet. This is probably where we'll keep like all of our games, all of that kind of stuff in here. Yep. Yeah, so that's where our kitchen table will go. So it's a pretty big area. And it's actually Quite a bit bigger than I was thinking, too. So right here, there's going to be a balcony. You can't see it right now, but there's going to be a place right here um, where you're going to be able to sit like chairs and stuff. Like and probably two chairs and a small table or something else. Yeah, nothing there. like big, but just enough. And then there's this uh, little window right here as well, right as you go up the stairs, where there's going to be this beautiful view with the mountains and yeah, everything. The view from this window is probably going to be the best view in the house. It's going to yep. be amazing. Yep. Ready to go upstairs? Yeah. Okay. So the lighting up here is really bad because of it's not fully framed up here. So, but. when we got a really big discount when we, when we were putting an offer on this house, because <laughs> it doesn't come with a roof. It doesn't come with a roof. So you walk like, what? walk up the stairs and you come in, and this will be walking into our master bedroom. 
So you walk in, and the one thing that I love the most about our master bedroom is how many windows there are. So you have this great big picture window, and, and then as well as on either side, yeah, and then on either side of the bed, we have long windows. So this is the room, this is where the bed will go. And then it's right here. And then I'm not gonna walk over because they've got all this wood in the way. All right, we'll walk over. So you walk over here. And this is the doorway here. For the master. So you'll walk bath. into the master bath. That'll be the toilet. Here's the vanity. And then the big tub. And then if this I can get past this closet. wood. Here's gonna be some like built-ins, just like open shelving. And then in here, whoop, threshold. You walk in here and this whole thing is our master closet. It is huge. Huge, huh, Jax? Okay, all right, so once again, there's the stairs, that was the master bedroom. So once you walk down this little hall, you'll come up to, this is gonna be Jax's bathroom. So it's another full bath up here. So four bathrooms. And then, this will be laundry. This is gonna be, the, they don't have it framed out right now, but this is gonna be the laundry room. It's actually quite large, which is gonna be nice. And then these are the two bedrooms. So upstairs, we'll, yeah. The two upstairs bedrooms. So we'll let Jax probably choose. Um, I have ideas. We'll probably, we'll probably give him the options, but Kurt and I do have our opinion on what we want him to be. We'll probably give him this one over here because the laundry room is right next to this bedroom right here. So like when we were doing the like laundry, it would just be a little bit louder and stuff. So it just kind of depends. The view from this room is better, um, but this room is also a little bit more convenient. It's got this big window and then a little window which we thought would be perfect to put his dresser right under the little window. So I don't know, but it's, once again, these views from these windows are just incredible. There's, I mean, just looking over the mountains like that every day, it's gonna be amazing. And Jax just loves it so much. Jax, do you want this to be your bedroom? Yeah. Yeah? I'm, what do you think about it? I'm gonna do that one. Hey, what do you think about it? Uh, I'm gonna get down. You wanna get down? There's a I'll lot of you. stuff up but here to get down at. it's kinda dangerous right now. Oh and my it's gosh, kinda, it's so kinda, excited. It's kinda fun to be able to like, watch like, your place go up. I know it's kinda framed already, but like, just like seeing this side of it, like seeing it be built. Being built. I think you can take a little bit more pride in it in the long run as yeah. well. And it's making, I think it's making me feel a little bit more excited and more of a homeowner, if that makes any sense. Being able to be the one to make some of the decisions and choosing what to change and what to keep um, and kind of customizing it to the way that we want it. I think that makes me feel more involved in the situation and in this process because this process I know can be super crazy. So we feel really, really good about it. We are so, so excited. My little boy is in heaven. He was like meant to be here. You guys, this is our house. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. things that I think we're the most excited about is flying the drone around, taking pictures of the house in all of its stages. And right now it's really cool to watch because the roof isn't on yet, so you can kind of see down into the home a little bit. So it's really cool. So we're excited to kind of do a timeline progression of the way that the house takes place. Hey, where are you? Hello, Munchkin. Hi. What are you doing? Are you look hey, where's your face? Boo! I love you. I love you. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> I love you. Do you love our house? How much do you love our house? Yes. 
Oh gosh, you're so cute, Jax. 